to the unboxers and today we have for you an awesome resin statue of dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, our buddy Obi-Wan. So I'm just going to show you the writing down there. It is Obi-Wan Kenobi from One Six Scale Statue. A New Hope. Yes. There you go. Now you can see it is humongous in the studio. So we want to say a great big thank you to Diamond Select for sending him to us for free to share with you today. So he already looks awesome on the a actual outside of the package. Yeah. Um, I can't wait to see what he looks like in person. All right. So let's turn him around. So there's like the side view. That's cool. And there's an extreme close up um, of Obi-Wan. He looks he looks spot on to me. Yeah, it really looks awesome. Very, very cool. And it says it's limited to 2,000 pieces. Wow, that is awesome. It is, uh, yeah. This is part of their, uh, I don't know if you can see it, but it's part of the Milestones collection. All right. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get Obi-Wan out of this box so we can give you a much closer look. We'll be right back. All right, and we're back. And here's Obi-Wan out of the box. It wow, he's phenomenal. Yes, he's even bigger than I thought. Sometimes, yeah. you know... Um, when you get them out of the package, um, they're much smaller, but I think he is quite a great size um, resin statue. Well, and part of it is, you know, because they can do the, like, because he's actually in three pieces, the base, right. the lightsaber, and then him, so you can pack it in a smaller box. It doesn't have to... Right, right. You know. But it's a lot of protection there. Yeah. So, um, yeah, there is a peg on the bottom of the foot that you do not see. It's under his cloak. It actually has a shoe and everything. Yeah. And so it's a finished figure, but it has a um, a steel see. peg that pegs him onto no, this awesome see. base. And I love that they have recreated the background yes. um, from this part of the story. Um, he does have an awesome collector card. So let's take a look at that. So he's got an awesome collector card, which tells you he is number 74, 74 out of 2,000. So I knew he was a limited number, but I didn't know he was actually numbered. That is awesome. All right. And then he also has the lightsaber, like you said, that comes off. Um, so um, it's going to be... It's nice that they do that so that you can, you know, if you have to pack it to store, you know, to move or anything. Right. You can take it apart and not have to worry about it getting broken. So I'm going to zoom in because he is quite, he's quite heavy too, um, as these figures usually are. But I want you to be able to see the detailing. Look at the detailing on his face. Very, very cool. And as I spin him some, you can see the beard, the front of his cloak, um, the handle of the lightsaber. And look at his, his hands look so real there. Yeah. Um, the sculpting of his hands. Um, even the inside of the cloak, which is really cool. So he, so this is this one has sleeves as well. Like mm -hmm. it's not just, and then it's got like the, if you can see, it's got the like the scarf pieces or whatever that come hang down. Um, he does look like you know it does look like because they're always in the dust. Yeah. It does look very dusty down there. Here's the base, which has like the grooves cut in um, these like slate flooring or whatever type flooring it is. Um, for that scene, um, there's his brown shoes. I'm going to bring it up a little bit again. Let's turn around again so we can see a little bit of the background. So this is what the background looks like. It's got, it almost looks like it's, you can see through it. Yeah. Um, but it's you, got that you really can't. It's got that like, um, you know, that Star Wars looking wall yes. that they always had on the Death Star. And it looks almost like a sky and clouds reflective off of there reflecting um i don't think it is i don't know if it's just made like that or if that's the lighting of that scene but looks really cool here's the back of his cloak there's the back of him with the hood so i'm going to zoom in so you can see all of the different um layers of the hood how it falls how it's sculpted and then keep turning him a little bit so we can see the other side as he turns around Wow, he looks spot on. Yeah. He looks like he's absolutely you know, right out statue. of the movie. They did a superb job on him. If we can slide him back a little bit, we can probably get everything in, except for maybe the tip of the lightsaber. Let's see, here's the tip. So the tip is like right up here. Yeah, you can um, take it off if you, and you can see, Yeah, you can see how long it is. That's really cool. You can see like all the... Translucent you know, blue. You can see like the detail in the... Oh, and the handle part, Lightsaber yes. Lightsaber itself, yeah. Awesome. 
And that just pegs right back in. All right. So there's Obi-Wan Kenobi from... From A New Hope. And we want to say another great big thank you to... Diamond Select. For sending him to us for free to share with you today. He is an awesome resin statue. And he's going to look great next to the other Star Wars ones. Yeah, and I, uh, I don't think I mentioned earlier, but this is actually... Um, a lot. Of, this is actually done by uh, General Giant Studios, who does a lot of their high-end um, Star Wars stuff. So it looks really awesome. They did yeah. a great job. Thank you so much for watching. As always, come back and see us. Like, subscribe, and we will see you next time. Mm -hmm.